Hello, and welcome to the Church of Fuck You. I'm St. Patrick. Well, church, I must confess, I am fucking done with love. Fuck love. Royally fuck love. I'm so tired of it. I am sick of the amount of bullshit that comes with the word love. Like, have you ever noticed that the people who claim to love you the most are the ones that fuck you over the most. Now I'm not talking about just regular like, you know, hey, they did something bad, like they stomped on your foot or something like that. I mean royally fuck you over. Like fellas, we all have that, that best friend, that dude we grew up with, you know, we was in elementary school together, we did everything together, you know what I'm saying? I love you, you love me, we boys, and then turn around and he's trying to fuck your girl behind your back? What? Oh, women, you have that, that, that sister. You know, that's my best friend. That's my girl. We do everything together. I love her. She loves me. That's how it's going to be. We're going to die. Best friends forever. BFFs. And as soon as you leave the room, that bitch is the first one talking shit behind your back. What happened to love? You know, I'm really starting to think this world does not understand the definition of what love is supposed to be. Even some people's version of God doesn't understand what love is. You'll have a dude sit in a hospital with no legs, no arms. You know, he was in a car accident. He lost his wife. He lost his kids. And what is the first thing some dumbass says to them? Oh, God loves you because he allowed you to live. That's love? That's love. See, I'm so fucking done with love, period. Love is just the epitome of the word retardedness because it makes people stupid. I'm, you think I'm joking? Find an abused woman. What is like one of the main reasons they always give is why they can't leave this man? Because I love him. Dudes, some dudes out here fucking with girls who are just, I mean, just dirty as shit. They, they're fucking everybody and fucking anything that moves. They, you know, scheming behind his back. They're doing all this kind of just crud ball shit. And what is the one reason why he can't leave her? Because he loved her, man. That's my heart. You know what I'm saying? I love her. That's my girl. Really? When did love just make everyone so fucking stupid? When did love just become just this thing that blinds people to the truth? Now, I know we talk shit about religion, but is love any better? How many people have died in the name of love? How many people have killed in the name of love? How many people have done the most ridiculous shit in the name of love? And now, don't even get me fucking started on being in love. That is this... You know what? I think people use love as a way to say, hey, I fucked up. Or when I fuck up, I love you, so you're supposed to forgive me. Because in my world, in my, my personal definition, is if you love someone, you shouldn't have to repeatedly apologize for the same shit. Like, if you fuck up, love should stop you from fucking up again and again and again and again and again. No, that's not fucking love. And maybe I just have a skewed definition of what love is, but love is not repeatedly fucking somebody over. Love is not fucking that girl's best friend and then fucking her friend and fucking her friend and fucking some other girl in her bed and fucking some other girl in her car and they come back saying, baby, I love you, I'm sorry, I just messed up. That's bullshit. Women, you can't keep going around fucking everybody or, you know, cleaning out a dude's bank account and doing all like a shysty and shady shit and they come back saying what? Oh, baby, I love you. Please forgive me. Fuck that. See, I, you know what? Let, let's, let me paint you a little picture real fast. You know how you start a new relationship and you like that person and you really like that person and, you know, you do anything in the world to make that person smile and, you know, you, like, the, somebody says that person's name, hey, man, you see Michelle today? And a smile just instantly come across your face like, yeah, man, you know, I saw her, you know, she at home, I'm gonna go hit her up later. That's how love should be. So from now on, I don't want fucking love. I want like, like me. Do what you feel that, you, you know, I'm sorry, let me rephrase that. Like me to the point where you won't fuck me over. Like me to the point where you won't do shysty or, or cruddy shit to just, I don't know, just be a fucking asshole. Like me. Like, I tell my wife flat out, if I ever get to the point where I don't like you and I feel you don't like me, then what the fuck are we here for? You need to bounce. I need to bounce. We need to fucking leave. I want to be liked because love in this day and age is fucking garbage. Love will have somebody stab you in the back and shit on you and steal your car and then steal your money and they come back and be like, man, look, man, I messed up, man. I'm sorry. You know what? I love you. We have love. Let's keep this shit together. No, I, I don't want that shit anymore. Fuck all that.
I don't want family love. I don't want relationship love. I don't want any of that love because love today is fucking garbage. Give me like because people you generally like, you don't try to fuck over. People you generally like, you try to make them happy. You go out of your way to do things to make them happy and you go out of your way to see them and be with them. We all know people who are in love. They've been fucking married and in love for 20 years and can't sit in the same fucking room for 15 minutes without arguing and wanting to kill each other. Fuck love. Give me like. That's the new theme for this, for going forward. Fuck that. Now, fine, some of you may say, oh, I gotta have love. Fine, you want love, fine, love. But like me first. And whoever you're with, you should be able to like them first. If you don't like them, then get the fuck away from them. Because this love shit is fucking garbage. All right, man, that's it. Thanks for watching. Thanks for listening. This is St. Patrick. I'll see you later.